up in St. Stephen uh, Saturday. Yes, we will. For Catch the Catfish Festival. Festival. Looking forward to that. They actually fish all day Friday. And then cook all day Saturday, and of course they got the rides and yeah, all they, that other stuff all going on Saturday. Huge, huge. What happens if they don't catch anything on oh, Friday? Oh, they do. You go fishing in St. Stephen, you go catch yeah. them. Because if they if they don't officially catch anything, Johnny goes out there and throws dynamite off the boat. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just say you're going to catch something in St. Stephen? Yeah, fish. You, yeah, you sure oh, do. Okay. Fish. <laughs> Catfish. Especially around that sweet pea thing. <laughs> now, the catfish judging starts, what, 5 o'clock? Yeah. And the sweet pea contest, which we are emceeing, is at 6 o'clock. Mm -hmm. That's where those guys dress up as women. Oh, yeah. I know what it is. <laughs> yeah, well, we were part of that one year, remember? Yeah, I remember how excited you got. <laughs> Last year, a prisoner won. <laughs> they did. They, got, they, yeah. they had to get a fella out of jail. And I don't think he even had, they had to give him a dress. I think he had one anyway. He? he wore the one he was wearing in jail. <laughs> no, no, he, no, no. And that he ended right. up winning. I think so. I think right. it was part of his parole. I'm not sure. I wonder how many calories are in that catfish stew we got to eat. Well, we just sample it. I wonder if they'll have, like, calorie labels on it. I'm worried about the you know? sherbet they give us to I'm sure clean our palate. Nah. I'm sure they will list what they have in there. You think they <laughs> yeah. do? You can count on that. Some of it's pretty good. Oh, yeah. Some of it is really good. Some. Others aren't. Well, of course. I mean, there's some better than others. That's the way it always is in a, in a cooking contest. Mm -hmm. Well, you're not going to be there this year, right? I can't be there this year. That's right. Why? Huh? Why? They made that agreement with him last year after he took his clothes off on stage <laughs> that he wouldn't come back. I've been banned for it one year from uh, from being at the uh, Catfish being part Festival. Of it, right? I'll be a part of it next year, but I got naked on stage last year, and they well apparently didn't like that. Don't don't y'all? That's not completely true. It wasn't. No, he just. No, threw... I still had on pantyhose and boxer shorts. <laughs> but it was funny. Did that? He got mad because he lost, or thought you know they he was. Pretending, mm -hmm. and he uh, no, I was mad. He was. Award. Yeah, he likes to win. He thought he was pretty. I'm very competitive, and you guys keep saying, "Well, you can't win," and I knew it was something that you had done, where you wouldn't let me win. You had fixed it. Did you see yourself in that dress? Yeah, but I also saw the other ones too. <laughs> I mean, come on, a prisoner won. <laughs> You threw off. You picked a prisoner. You threw that flowery hat that you were wearing and the wig off on the ground right there on stage, and then yanked the dress. Running around back to get out of the off the stage, you pull your dress off yeah. right on stage. I walked out Ricky. of there in pantyhose and boxer shorts. I made my. Was she my wife yet? No. Yes. Think, yes, she was. Yes, she was. We were. We you know were when you got married? Newlyweds. Can you tell me what day you got March married? March 14th. Well, yes, you were. Yeah, we were married. There and she was beat red. When she you... was appalled is what it was. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, had, I had, Ricky, I had some splaining to do. Because she, she thought she was the only one that got to see him in boxer shorts and pantyhose after they got married. But, you know. New York Life, the only choice to help guarantee.